Hi, sweets. It's so incredibly hard to summarize how I feel about you in words that won't take an hour, but time to give it my best shot. This day in this moment is something I have been dreaming of since I was a little girl. I would say six-year-old me would be so proud that the man on the other side of this chair is a man like you. It's way too cliche to say that it was love at first sight, but I swear that is something that we're living out to be true. I vividly remember my first time meeting you in person in my backyard next to the famous Grasso's Bar. I remember exactly what you were wearing and it included my favorite version of Backwards Hat Joe. You texted me right after asking to spend more time together that week and lucky, lucky for me, that more time has turned into forever time. We've been saying to each other for a while now that we just have it so good. Our love is easy, easy and connected. It's our Sundays at 4 p.m. eating Chinese, takeout and binging true crime TV shows. It's our road trips where our conversations are in the form of dance moves to groovy music and deep talks, but also the form of comfortable silence while listening to our favorite lyrics. It's staying young together by building a fort in every single apartment we have ever lived in. And lastly, it's growing as individuals into the people we were meant to be, yet never growing apart, always encouraging one another and never making the other feel inferior. At this exact moment, I am promising to you that forever is not just a word I use lightly and marriage is not just a title. It's me knowing for damn certain you are the man I want influencing our future children, the person I want to share around 80,000 meals with, which half of which will be Uber Eats, my travel and concert companion, and the person whose day I genuinely care to hear about for the rest of my life. From this day forward, I vow to always choose you. When our love faces mountains, I vow to take your hand and never leave you behind. I vow to always communicate my needs and truly listen to yours so we can always continue to grow and water our love. I vow to always date you even after we settle down in life, to put in the work to make you feel as safe, loved, and special as you make me feel, to always show up on the good days and even on the bad days. But above all else, I vow to be your best friend, to always make you laugh and to add magic into your life during times of badness, and to never let a day go by without telling you that I love you and that you're handsome in squeezing you if I must. You set my world on fire and I'm head over heels in love with you. I vow to give you my all out effort to make you see yourself how I see you every day for the rest of our life. life. Mine always love your soon to be wife. It's freaking wedding day. I can't believe after 500 days of engagement, the big day has finally arrived. The day I met you, you were in a dress and you looked so dang beautiful. I thought this girl was way out of my league. What's the catch? But there wasn't one, and you somehow turned out to be even more beautiful of a person on the inside. And today I get to see you again in a dress for the first time, and I know you're going to take my breath away just like the first day we met. I knew after the first few weeks of dating that you could be the girl I want to spend the rest of my life with. We went to the wine festival, Indians games, hiking, concerts, and endless bopping. I got to meet your family at alumni and had the time of my life. Getting to marry into such a loving family really is a blessing. I'm just thankful they still approved of me after showing up to day two of alumni in the same exact clothes. Some couples try to avoid their in-laws, but I get so excited thinking about a lifetime of vacations, holidays, and pool parties with your family. But what I look forward to the most is a lifetime of adventures with you, and Doodle, of course. When I think of the hundreds of adventures we've been on together, I always go back to our trip to Mackinac. After all, that is, that's where I told you I was in love with you after just three weeks of dating. Doesn't seem so crazy now, though, does it? I'm so freaking excited I get to marry you. You're my person, and you make everything in life so much brighter. You always joke, don't dull my sparkle, and I vow that I will never ever try to dull that sparkle. It's one of my favorite things about you. You make me feel alive and motivated to do anything in life. And I can't tell you how many times I've been on the edge of wanting to do something, and you convince me, and we end up having the best freaking time. I'm trying to think of words to describe your love, but there's really no way I could put anything on this paper that comes close. It's not something I can put into words, but it's something but it's just the way you make me feel. Every second I'm with you. I feel so loved. It gives me chills to even think about it. I'm so in love with you and I vow to always try and make you feel so loved and special. We both love love and I know deep down our love is going to last forever. I vow to never lose the passion in our relationship, to always seek new adventures, to do everything I can to provide for you, to provide and protect our family, to start taking the plastic cover off the hell of a dip, to be your biggest cheerleader in life, and to fall more deeply in love with you every single day of our lives. I can't wait to call you my wife. I love you forever and always. 
Amen. Amen.